Aloha, you sports fans. We're here at the Stan Sheriff Center where the Hawaiian Airlines Rainbow Wahine Classic just wrapped up as Hawaii finished the weekend tournament with a sweep of 10th ranked UCLA. Early in the first set, the two teams were evenly matched as they exchanged points for most of the first half. But as the set reached its later points, Hawaii began to find its rhythm and gain separation. Hawaii would use a 6-2 run to build up an 18-11 lead and eventually win the set 25-18. The second set was very similar to the first. After UCLA battled for an early lead, Hawaii rallied back into the set and regained the lead midway through the set. From there, it was all Hawaii as the Rainbow Wahine cruised to a 25-17 win. In the third set, Hawaii dominated grabbing the lead early and holding up all attempts by the Bruins to get back into it. When it was all said and done, Hawaii won the third set 25-18 to, to finish off the sweep. It was nice. Uh, a lot less stress and uh, a lot less hard work. They're a good team and I think they weren't all there tonight, so I guess that was kind of nice. But for us, we came out alive and a lot of energy and really shut them down right away, so I think we're responsible for that. Well, I really didn't realize the scores uh, of each game until after the match, and uh, you know it's it's good to win like that. It's good to win easily sometimes, uh, but the games are actually pretty competitive up until about 15, and then our kids really uh, buckled down, and we managed to pull away in each of the games. The win allowed Hawaii to clinch the victory in the tournament, and several Rainbow Wahine were honored for their performances, as Setter Mita Uiato and libero Ali Longo were named to the all-tournament team. Hartong also made the team and was named the tournament's most outstanding player. Well, she has a complete game now. She's a good blocker, defender, obviously a great hitter. Um, she's becoming a really, really good all-around player. and uh, Just kind of a, you wind her up and you just let her go. and She's got a motor that just won't quit. It feels nice at the end to get the accolade, but I don't really think about it during or kind of forget about it by the time next tournament comes around. Hawaii will return to action next week as they host the Outrigger Hotels and Resorts Volleyball Challenge. The tournament will be the last of Hawaii's home tournaments and will run from September 12th to 14th. Reporting for Kaleo O Hawaii, I'm Jeremy Nita.